episode of Online Kid Church. I'm Andrew, and that there is Meredith. <laughs> she can say her name, believe it or not. So, uh, yeah, you know stuff. Do something. Um, today our story is about Lazarus. Lazarus was one of Jesus' good friends. What do you like doing with your friends? Our story today is from the Spark Story Bible. Three of Jesus' good friends included a man named Lazarus and his sisters, Mary and Martha. Jesus was on a long journey when he found out that Lazarus was dying. It took Jesus a few days to travel to see his sick friend. When Jesus arrived, he saw Lazarus' sister, Martha. She had some sad news. Jesus, Lazarus is dead, cried Martha. I wish you could have arrived earlier. You might have been able to save him. Jesus tried to comfort her. Martha, don't be sad. Lazarus will live again. Martha believed what Jesus said. Then Lazarus' other sister, Mary, came to greet Jesus. She wished Jesus had arrived earlier, too. Jesus, if you had been there, Lazarus might still be alive, she wept. She also believed that Jesus could have healed her brother. Jesus was sad because Lazarus died, too. He cried and cried. Jesus, Martha, and Mary went to the tomb where Lazarus was buried. Jesus told some people standing there, Take the stone away from the tomb. The people were surprised at what Jesus said. Martha reminded Jesus that Lazarus had been dead for four days. They, they had already made his body ready for burial wrappings it in special clothing. But Jesus knew what he was doing. He insisted that they open the tomb. When the heavy stone was rolled away, Jesus said, Lazarus, come out. The people were frightened and amazed when Lazarus came out of the tomb. Since his hands and feet were all wrapped up in burial clothes, the people had to help Lazarus. When the people saw Lazarus alive again, they all laughed and sang and danced. Many people that day believed Jesus would bring new life to all people. Here's your question for your family. If you had been Lazarus' friend, how would you feel after he died? How would you feel after he came alive again? Today's bottom line is, Jesus gives you new life. On the count of three, let's say that together. One, two, three. Jesus, Jesus gives, gives new life. life. Jesus gave new life to Lazarus. Jesus can give new life to us. What do you think that means? Let's close today with a prayer. Everyone bow your head and fold your hands. Dear Jesus, some kids are crying right now. We pray for kids in hospital. Please help these kids to get better soon. We pray for kids in places of war. Please help these kids be safe and help them to find food. We pray, we pray for kids who are sad in their homes. Please help these kids to find family and friends to talk to. Thank you for being our friend, and for loving us whenever and wherever we are sad. Amen. Thank you for joining us for our first ever episode of Online Kids Church. If you want to host Online Kids Church at your house, have your parents contact our mom, Miss Renee. Thanks for joining us. Toodles. But wait, there's more. I think you have an announcement. Go for it. Yes. Remember to keep filling up your fish banks for one great hour of sharing. We're not really sure when they will be turned in right now, but we'll make sure to keep you posted. All right, I think that's all for now. Toodles. It's cool. Was that good? It is really cool. <laughs>